Oh my gosh, we are so psyched. We actually found one of the monkeys at Silver Springs. Wow, they are... <laughs> What's up YouTube? Hey guys, welcome back to the Citrus Fam. So we are back here for part two of Silver Springs Park here in Ocala, Florida. We're doing the water part. We're going to be going down this river. I think it's what, 5.2? Yeah. 5.2 miles. So I don't know how we're going to do it on the paddleboard, so I don't actually know how long it's going to take or um, yeah, or how, how it's going to go. It is encouraging just because we are going with the current, so we're hoping that will help speed us along a little, but we are being joined by my family today. So both my parents and my sister is here from Virginia, so we are excited to have them a little bit in our videos, and we'll just keep you guys updated as we go down the river. So stay tuned, and let's get started. There they have where you can actually rent paddle boards and kayaks. And you go about five miles down the river and they'll come back and pick you up. All right, y'all ready? Alright, so as we go today, don't think you're staying double, but we have my sister here. She's from Virginia and it's her first time at Silver Springs Park. What do you think so far? It's really pretty. The water's great. Yeah, so like I showed, the water is crystal clear, if you can see right beside me. And so far there's no breeze, so it's really nice. You can see straight down to the bottom and even right here where we put in, there's tons of fish. So I think it'll be lots of cool stuff to see.
we just passed mile marker 3.2 and we've got a little less than two miles to go. I think about a mile and a half, but there's a lot of places that the current is really strong and oh, hold on. <laughs> that the current is really strong and if you do get tired you just kind of steer around it up oh. there are places where the current is pretty strong so if you do get tired you can just kind of steer and it will carry you down but i do have to say it is one of the prettiest stretches of water i think i've done there's a lot of really shallow places a lot of uh, really deep places. You can see a lot of fish. We saw tons of wild wildlife. We have seen three alligators. We have a few clips of those, but the water is crystal clear. It is really pretty. We are here on a Wednesday and it is pretty, it's pretty quiet. I've honestly never seen, just hit the tree. <laughs> I've honestly never seen so much wildlife, but it's beautiful. So psyched. We actually found one of the monkeys at Silver Springs. Wow, they are. Okay, well that was scary. He tried to get me, but Apparently they, don't like they are here. Well, they attacked all of us when we were in Asia. They that is so cool. They really are at Silver Springs Park. What do you think? Did that just make your whole trip? Uh, well, yes, you almost getting attacked. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was so cool. I'm glad we finally saw a monkey. Was, was that worth the five mile? Uh, it would, have been, it would have definitely been worth it if it would have jumped on your board with you. That thing tried to get me, you guys. <laughs> Not even kidding. That would have, that would have I couldn't been... steer and film, and he that, didn't like how close I was getting. That could have gone viral. <laughs> oh my gosh, except that I would have fallen in the water and lost your phone, and we would have never had it. That would have been bad. Could have been the best video oh my gosh. Could have been a million dollar video. Okay, right and there. if you see the camera shaking, it's because I freaked <laughs> out. I need, I need you to go back. <laughs> oh, 
But that was really cool. Keep an eye out for the monkeys. Those things are huge. What do you think, Dad? How'd you see that thing? I don't know. <laughs> definitely wasn't neutered. All right, so we have finally made it the 5.2 miles down Silver Springs River. And we are turning at, what was it called? Ray Wayside, Ray Wayside Park. So we put in at the main Silver Springs Park um, at their kayak launch. And we are, we brought the car down here so that we could get picked up. They do have a shuttle service so that you can pay them to come pick you up, but it's $15 a person to be brought back to the park. So we just decided to drive. All right, you guys, we are back from the park. We went and got some ice cream and just did a few family things. So we weren't uh, able to do an actual outro there. So we'll just end it here. But what'd you think? I think that uh, it was a very long journey. Yeah. It was beautiful. Um, definitely highly recommend it if you are able to spend a couple of hours out there um, on kayaks or paddle boards. We saw tons of animals. I think we saw turtles, at least four alligators, manatees, um, the monkey. So that was a really interesting experience. Um, we did learn they're called, I believe it's pronounced rhesus monkey. Uh, we'll, we'll put the name down here, but um, they are, I think the thing was like 40 pounds maybe? I don't know, it was, it was yeah. a, uh, just like a little bitty monkey. Yeah, I was expecting like a spider monkey size and no, this thing was like bigger than a dog. It, it was really impressive. Definitely not what I was expecting, but. My, my thing with it was, it was cool that we got to see so many different animals. Like that was cool. And we probably wouldn't have seen so many different animals if we only spent like an hour on the water, but it's literally like the, the same thing the entire way. Like woods free water like after about an hour and a half of that you're like okay this is this is good but when we started like we were gonna do f the five miles the full thing and there's really no turning back the current is very strong so there's really no going back and uh the way that we had set it up to where we had moved the cars to where we had one car to drive us back we didn't really have a choice so I think it took us, it was over three hours. Yeah. It was probably was close to four. Say three to four, yeah. It was close to four hours that we spent. And it's just a long time to just be. It's really beautiful though. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't beat the view, but. Yeah, I would just... say definitely do it at least once. Um, bring a snack, bring water, bring, you know, all the things that you need. It was hot. We put on sunscreen, I think a couple of times, but just like he said, the experience of seeing that many different types of animals just in the Florida nature was was definitely worth the experience. There was a, another point where you could get out at, and that was probably at the two mile mark, I believe yeah. is what it was. And that probably would be what most people do, mm -hmm. would be the two miles. And that's not too bad. I think that was a little over an hour, but when we, got to the two mile mark we still had three more miles to go yeah. and we weren't even halfway and I was already kind of like you know I was hungry it was noon at that time so it was fun though we got to see a lot of different animals we saw one huge alligator mm -hmm. and uh, the monkey which was a lot of fun because it almost attacked Ashley <laughs> and uh, I didn't think it was very much fun but Ashley I actually got to uh, chase after a manatee mm -hmm because it went right underneath us, we didn't even see it. Yeah. And she went back upstream, I just waited because I didn't feel like using all my energy to it chase after It was her. exhausting going back upstream. It took like every ounce of my energy and we were already at the end, so, but it was it was really cool because, I mean, you could almost reach out and touch it. It was, it was really fun. It was a good time though. Um, we got to spend some time with Ashley's sister and her parents and we got to see a lot of cool uh, exotic animals that you don't get to see every day. So it was, it was a good time, I'm glad we did it. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please comment what your favorite animal that we saw was. And please be sure to hit that subscribe button and come along with us on our next adventure. All right, bye guys. See ya.